Hello everybody, good morning. So, today's video is gonna be... Whoa! I'm zooming in for absolutely no reason. Today's video is gonna be a bit different because I was like, yo, I have so much to do today. I should vlog it. And that's how I came up with the idea of this video. So, consider it a day in the life. There's a few things we have to do on the agenda. First things first, I'm gonna read this. But also, my baby, my prized possession, ladies and gentlemen, gentlemen her. she is not working yet again. I don't know if you guys caught this, but briefly I mentioned it in my Whistler vlog. And bad news, my computer's not turning on. So yeah, it's actually, it's turning on this time. It's just, it does not stay on if I unplug it. So I asked them and they said, your battery is fried. So now I'm gonna have to go get it repaired. The Apple store, which is like half an hour away. But that means more time with you guys, so cheers. Also, another thing that happened that's very devastating. Look at her, she's broke. So, I'm gonna call the nail place today and ask, yo, what can we do for my nails? That's how I'm gonna ask it too. Yeah, and we'll see what she says. Okay, bye. Isn't she sexy? Hi everybody. Just got back from the gym. I'm now eating a poke bowl and it's very, very yum. I gotta admit, I haven't had a poke bowl in a really long time. And I was driving past and I was like, what am I craving right now? Poke bowl, so good. Also, a little fiasco happened. I lost my headphones and then I found them, but I lost them and I didn't have them while I was at the gym. And anyone that ever works out ever knows that you need music to work out. And although the gym has music, it's always like, it's not really what you're wanting. <laughs> yeah, I'm just gonna eat my poke bowl. I'm gonna hop in the shower. I was gonna try today, but um, I'm running late as per usual. So we need to pack her up. So I'm gonna go do that, get into the car. I swear to God, I'm late for everything in my life. All the time. I'm always late. My two flaws, my only two flaws, is that I'm late for everything and I also lose everything. So that's bad, mm. but I do have the coolest boobs, so I think that makes up for it. Let's go to the mall today. <laughs> uh, there's something in my eye. Oh, it feels like hand sanitizer. Ow. I do not remember where anything is in this mall. I haven't been here in a while, and it is the most dead I've ever seen it. Like, what the heck? If you live in Vancouver, or Burnaby, or just anywhere in the lower mainland, you know that this place is always bumping. I'll see you when I get to the Apple store. This is either going to be free, which the guy told me on the phone, he was like, oh, I think it's gonna be free, or it's going to be hundreds and hundreds of dollars. No in between, so let's cross our fingers, even though I can't do that. Your girl needs to pee so bad. And also, it's gonna cost a couple hundred. So um, my bank account is crying. Oh no, Sephora. Oh. Oh, I need to go into, oh, I need to go into there. I really do. Okay, I need to pee first. I really, really need to pee. I used to go to the small all the time, and now I don't know it at all. I don't even know where I am right now. Okay, there's an exit sign here. Oh, there's a matinette store. Oh my God, I need to stop being so distracted. I see a bathroom. <laughs> We're going to the bathroom. Holy woman. God, certain people, man, they've just never seen a vlogger in their lives. So here's a pro tip. If you're staring at someone, just make it a little less obvious. All right, so here's the thing. I'm gonna go to Dynamite because they have really good jeans for me. She wore those jeans like me. And I need jean shorts. So we're gonna go try on some jean shorts and possibly, probably other things, <laughs> knowing me. Hello, everybody. So we're just gonna do a quickie look at what I grabbed today. I did these black shorts, these kind of cream colored cargo shorts, these light wash, these kind of um, longer, a little bit ripped, this blue top, which I find is really cute. And then I just did this like fun little dress, kind of, I don't know, kind of reminds me of like Y2K sort of vibe. All right, I don't know how I feel about these shorts. I feel like they kind of fit weird. I don't know. Then this top, this top makes me feel like a tennis mom. Like all I need is like some shades and like a wine glass. Wait, hold on. I have the perfect thing. I think I have, yeah, I have my sunglasses. Oh yeah, Brendan's doing just great. He's going to McGill for engineering, yeah. Yeah, I forced him into it, but he's gonna love it. Literally, like that's the vibes. Wait, we're gonna zip it up, see if that's different. Do I like it? This is just a no. Okay, let's try on different shorts. 
Um, I don't know how I feel about these, just for the fact that they make my legs look even shorter than they already are. And if you know me, you know I have really, really short legs, and things that make them look shorter, I'm not a fan of, so I don't really know. Don't think so. It's kind of a bust. I'm kind of sad. <laughs> Okay, I did not know these fit like this. How are you doing so far? I'm good, yeah, I'm doing well. Thanks. Yeah, no worries. Yeah, these like fit not how I thought they would. And also, what the frick is the back? That is so weird. Sorry, I just showed you my butt. Okay, these are actually fitting the best out of all of them. So we have a winner, but the one thing is, do I love the color? I mean, I could definitely work with this. I kinda like the cream. I'm gonna ask the girlie's opinion while I try on the dress. The big chevet. Okay, so I put on the dress, and I don't know how I feel about it. I'm like, I don't know if it weird goes down so low to, I don't know, I don't know. We'll, we'll see what the girls think. I do like it though, maybe. <laughs> Oh, okay, my friend D said, oh my god, stop, I love that Shelby, what the f It's also only $50, which is pretty good for a dress. And they also really like the white shorts, so. I'm just gonna try on these, these shorts with the dress, because that makes sense. Actually, I think I do like them, and I just need more shorts. You know what, you know what, ladies and gents? I'm just gonna f*** it and huck it. A wise man once said, f*** it and huck it. I, in fact, said yes to the dress. My coworker just texted me being like, yo, you wanna come in? And I'm like, yes, please, because I need money very bad. All right, everybody, I ended up getting the black shorts and the, uh, the dress. Okay, we're gonna try to put the camera on this dash while you guys are here. So you'll see how much of an annoying setup this is. Okay, so I need it to go up. Okay, hello. I found the greatest life hack of all time. So, that's what we're using right now. I have to turn off lemon twigs because I don't want to get copyrighted. I don't even know if they would copyright me. I hope I know how to get home. So, one story time I actually want to tell you guys because I don't know if you noticed. Woo! Oh, I did the wrong way. Oh, I'm in the wrong, I'm in, Oh no, there's a man. There's somebody coming. I'm going the wrong way. He's so confused. I'm so sorry. I'm stupid, dude. Oh, exit. Exit. That's what I like to see. Okay, so here's my story time. I was, if you guys heard before, when I was um, in my room vlogging, you might have heard like a bunch of people talking and music outside and you would have been like, what is going on? Is there a party? All we do is f***ing party. All we do is f***ing party. First of all, no, there's a virus out there. I'm not having any parties as much as I would love to have a party right now. And also, there's a bunch of men working in my house. So, you know, like throughout the weeks, like right now they're doing painting, which is a very tiring job for everyone because, you know, you have to clear out your rooms and make it appropriate for painting. Anyway, so the other week, I think there was, this was like maybe two weeks ago or something. They were cleaning off my roof. I'm like cleaning off the moss off my roof. And I just worked out. And I was like, Ma, I, got, I gotta go into the bathroom. Because the thing about our bathroom, you see, is there's a skylight right over the shower. Probably see where this is going. I needed to shower. And I was like, Mom, I really need to shower. Like, what do I do? She's like, wait 20 minutes. I was like, <laughs> So I'm just like sitting there like sweaty and gross, wanting to shower real bad. And, uh, and it, it turns out. Out, you know, they were still working after 20 minutes and I was like, okay, I can hear them on the other side of the house I'm in the clear. It'll be fine. I just need to get into the shower I go into the shower and you know, I'm naked in the shower as most people do and Directly over me right there. Just right there. There's a man like looking down at me cleaning off the roof Not trying to look at me hopefully, but he was looking down like near me and I was like and I just I just got into a little ball and I was like I didn't know what to do. I sprinted out, grabbed a towel, just ran out. And um, then like, I think a day later, I went outside my house and that guy was just sitting there like smoking a cigarette. I was like, hey, he probably saw me naked. <laughs> Love that. So yeah, it's my story time. Moving is such a pain in the butt. If you know me, you know that I've had my house for 24 years now. I've been living there my entire life. Ever since my older brother Jack was born, we've been living there. 
it's just craziness, man. Because our house is like quite outdated in the sense that, I don't know, it doesn't look modern at all. Probably the appliances in our house are the only new thing about it. Everything else is kind of outdated and looks straight from 97. So we just need to make it look modern, make it look nice, make it look sharp. And I'm just excited to move. But I think, honestly, I just know it's gonna hit me so hard. When I do move, I'm gonna be such a mess. I'm a mess. Oh my God, that is so pretty. There's this girl taking like pictures and like these purple flowers. That is gorgeous. And she looks really pretty too. Girl, you're looking, you're looking beautiful. Hopefully she's telepathic. Also, have you guys noticed I've gotten a little bit of a tan? And it feels very nice to actually have tanness. I love the sun. I love the sun. I love the summer. I love the sun. I love the heat. I love it all, baby. I got my driver's license last week. Just like we always talked about. You were so Britney Spears sang it. I got my driver's license last week, just like we always talked about. Oops, I did it again. You know what's the other sh thing about having people painting in your house? Not only is like the moving around and everything, but they're waking me up early. The other day, I woke up and I was so scared because I just heard like this like on my door and I was like, what the f Frick is that? I don't have a cat anymore. No animals. That's a human. Like, why are they doing that? Why are they crawling on the floor? <laughs> like a woodpecker. But it turns out it was a paintbrush because the guy was painting my door. And it was just very, oh, why am I going slow? That's why I keep yawning because my sleep is just. <laughs> Oh my god. Also, yesterday, dude, I edited for so long. I actually need to talk to you guys about this. We need to have a talk. So, as you probably have noticed, my uploads have not been very consistent. Like, rule number one of YouTube is consistency is key. You always gotta be consistent. But I haven't been. Why? I don't know. I'm literally finished school. I'm only working, not very much. I just procrastinate the shit out of editing, especially last video. A week and a half after I filmed it, I had only edited three minutes out of 14. So what did I do? That fateful Wednesday that you saw my last video, I edited from 10 a.m. to 5 p.m. The entire day, no procrastinating, just like buckling freaking down. And I actually got it done, and I'm pretty proud of myself. But then, I can say this because I'm gonna, it's gonna be already out there. I was planning on making my mom a Mother's Day slideshow, and Mother's Day is this Sunday. And since my computer's broken, I had to do it last night because the computer's not gonna be back until like, mid next week. So after editing for that long, I then had to try to find all these pictures of me and my mom, make a video, film a little bit for it, edit more. So technically I edited for like 10-ish hours. 10 hours, dude. That is ridic. Oh my God. You know what else is ridic? That man's, he's going way too fast. Don't you just wish there was cops around so people would learn their lesson? Like, okay, we've all sped. Let's not tiptoe around that. But those people that are going like just ridiculous fast. I'm just like, dude, dude, stop it. Real women vote for Trump. That's going to be the end of the vlog because I got to go to work. Thank you so much for watching. Like, comment, subscribe. Hopefully this wasn't a boring video. Editing Shelby, you'll have to do a lot of work to make this interesting. And yeah, I would do the thing, but I kind of like it more when it like ends abruptly.